Welcome back, everybody. Glad you're here. Uh, I got something completely new. I mean, I love the fact that when I'm out there just drifting across YouTube, the things that show up in my feed can be pretty obscure. And when I run across a crazy one or an obscure one or something I'm not familiar with, I immediately jump on it. So this one popped up and caught my interest right away because uh, it, it combines two of the two of the best things about life honestly um this <laughs> this is uh, a metal singer performs amazing grace which combines my you know as a christian i love hymns the classical hymns i love christian music uh i especially love heavy metal so I will, when you combine the two together i'm all for it i've i've heard renditions of this before in the past Amazing Grace is probably one of the most covered songs in the history of the world. Uh, I've heard it done a cappella with like pentatonics. I've heard it done in uh, in in rock versions with like I think there's a version by um uh um oh dad gummit not flogging Molly but the other one um ah uh, the Boston band come on the Boston Irish band name sailing up to boston who is it i can't believe i'm dropping the ball on the name of the drop dead dropkick murphys sheesh anyway they did a version i heard a live version of theirs in a bar for saint patrick's day that they recorded which was phenomenal um if you get a chance to listen to it, it's amazing to hear with the with the uh, bagpipes and the entire. I, I guess it was in a bar or or wherever it was. It sounded like it was in a bar. Uh, just the entire crowd singing along with it, and then they kicked in and did like a you know their version of it, and it was just it's really cool. Some people get it, some people don't. Some people think that you can't really do that with music. Some people think that you're more than welcome to. As long as you respect it, I don't care. As long as you make it your own, I don't care. Um, Amazing Grace, I think, is one of those songs that kind of transcends all musical boundaries, whether it's country, rock, heavy metal, ska, folk, acapella, whatever, you name it. I think it's one of those songs that can be applied um, across every genre, and the message is still the same, and it's probably one of the best messages ever written. And if you've ever seen the movie, I highly recommend the movie Amazing Grace. shows kind of like the history of the song. And the and the circumstances surrounding it in 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 Britain at the time, um, when they were trying to get slavery outlawed, and uh, the name of the name of the movie is called Amazing Grace, and it's really good. Uh, so I highly recommend that as well. So, without any further ado, uh, I ran across this. I clicked on it. I have not listened to it. I don't know this guy. His name is uh, Dan Vatch, I believe, V A S C. So I'm assuming he's European. Um, this was posted 10 days ago, so just in time for Easter. Uh, he has 691,000 subscribers, but I've never heard of him. Uh, I don't know who he's, if, if he sings with a band or anything like that, but this has 170,000 views. But more than likely, you have not heard it, and I have not heard it. So we're going to check this out and uh, just see how awesome it is. So without any further ado, this is Dan Vash doing the Metal Singer Performs Amazing Grace. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. I once was lost, but now I'm was blind but now I see so right off the bat that's a killer set of pipes and that is smooth um so he's obviously got the talent and I guess that explains why he has, you know, three quarters of a million subscribers. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's that man. That sounds really good. I'm glad he opened it like that because it really gave me a sense of like the tenor in his voice and like how pure it is. It's really good. Twas grace that taught my heart to fear and grace my. How 
I got to tell you, this is actually hitting me. So first of all, uh, going for, uh, I called him a pit tenor, I believe. And, and, and it should have been like, he was singing in baritone and then switched up to tenor and just easily transitioned that octave. He pulled out that harmonica and I was like, uh Oh, and, uh, man, it's hitting like a bag, like bagpipes hit me hard. If I hear bagpipes do an amazing grace, like, whether it's, it's Spock's funeral in, in the wrath of in the wrath of Khan, or you know, several times there was a golfer that died, and they honored him by playing. There was a lone bagpipe just out on the lawn, I think at St Andrews, like in this early morning, with like the mist, and he comes walking out of it playing this. And bagpipes and Amazing Grace go together just like. I mean, it's it's just a, like a core elemental joining in the universe. And when he pulled that out, I was like, "Ooh, a harmonica!" It's hitting the exact same way. He is that it is really crazy. I did not expect that. Um, I'm really impressed.
Oh, is there anything? Yeah, so you guys need to check out his his uh, channel. I need to check him out. I'm probably going to do that after I finish this. Dave, Dan, Dan Vatch. Um, holy cow, that was awesome. That was just amazing i just can't even describe it like that just hits you at like a core level and his vocals are stunning he just did that so perfectly like it's so easy to mess that up if you don't do it right to just like over inflect or to just to get too much into a scream and kind of like lose just the emotional power of it and kind of get into like the showing off part of it and he controlled that so well, it just came across so naturally. Like I was anticipating where he was going because he was just telling that story so well with his voice. Beautiful. Beautiful. I loved it, man. Dan, you killed it, brother. That was amazing. Everybody, you guys, I'm going to post every, all, every, all the information is going to be down below in the description. Please go to his channel, check him out, and, and subscribe, like. Please, hey, if you like this, please like it. I'd appreciate it. Comment below. I'd love to hear what you think about this. If you know this guy, you know, give me some information about him. But I'm definitely going to be checking out his channel here pretty soon as soon as I get off with you guys. And uh, yeah, just, just, hey, subscribe if you have not already because I love doing this stuff. If you have something else you'd like me to check out, please let me know. I'd love to hear it. I'd love to react to it and uh, turn you guys on to some more music you've never heard. In the meantime, Check out my other stuff I have over here, and I will see you next time. Y'all be good. I love you. Bye.